be. So imagine something as important. You know, when you arrest somebody, especially you arrest a kid, that kid has got an arrest record, which can tank their ability to get a job. And uh, it's was not discussed. Nobody but security had a look at it. So I filed freedom of information on it to see what kind of oversight there was on this. And as far as I can determine, um, of all the counselors responsible for corporate security, it's Frank Dale, because he's on the violence, vandalism, and uh, bullying task force. Uh, certainly, uh, that's the expectation, is that they would look at it. And I just want to know, did any counselor, anybody, see or have a look at the arrest policy? Or, you know, because otherwise it is not possible for um, the city of Mississauga elected officials to be so hypocritical. So this, this gap that I talk about between what is claimed and the reality of what goes on here has just widened even further. You know, you don't tell me you're a caring community if you've got a, an arrest policy that you allow uh, security to to write and to implement without any looking at it at all. And plus, me having told you for all these years, including sharing the database and how there's no oversight on that, and you're still not doing anything. There's got to be something in the council code of conduct about that kind of almost criminal negligence. Anyway, they're leaving now, and that means I better go. It is still Wednesday, January the 29th, 2014. This is what the Toronto Star looks like. And going to the City of Mississauga website, over here we're going to uh, click on City Hall. There's policies. And now here's something that I just discovered. There's all kinds of policies here online. See? Policies. Corporate policies accessibility, animals, so on, so on, so on, so on, and you get to security right here. You click on security, what kind of policies are online for the public to take a look at, and to their credit, there's a lot more than before. And uh, we've got closed circuit CCTV, code of conduct, uh, what is it, transit, video audio surveillance, recording incidents of city facilities and video surveillance. But the one that's not there is the arrest policy. And again, it's because it seems to be a departmental policy and not um, a, a corporate policy. And as a result, <laughs> one of the most important policies, in other words, how City of Mississauga arrests people, is not there. It's not there. And the effect that arrest would have on youth and minors is profound. And the answer is quite simple. The arrest policy is a departmental policy, not a corporate policy. And uh, earlier on last week, I'd asked for the arrest policy through the city clerk's office. And somebody who's really good at finding all kinds of policies online said she couldn't find it and assumed, therefore, that it's departmental. So, arrest policy, it's still a secret here at City of Mississauga. Training camera off. Don't crash the ambulance. I'm lucky. It's, it's awful, isn't it? Whatever you do. Training camera off.